We have an exciting product for people who suffer with mouth ulcers. One of the problems is we keep touching it with our tongue and that further irritates. Polyox has a unique mechanism that when it becomes wet, becomes like a Band-Aid, like a glue or mucilage, and it protects the ulcer. And I'm going to demonstrate the proper way of using polyox. First, the area that has the mouth ulcer needs to be moistened. So take a sip of water and wet the area. Take the cap off the polyox container. If the ulcer is in the back of the mouth, we may want to use an extender. If it's in the front of the mouth, extender is not needed. Now you're ready to apply the polyox. And just in front of the mirror, puff the polyox on the area of the ulcer and get a nice coating. Then take another sip of water. Swish it around vigorously as if you want to get rid of the polyox and expectorate. Reapply the polyox by puffing. It's kind of like painting. You'd like to get a lot of light coats rather than a really heavy coat. So puff it a few times to get a coating. Take another sip of water and expectorate. Do this about two or three times so there's a nice coating on the area where the ulcer is. This will work two ways. One, it acts like a Band-Aid so the tongue will not irritate the ulcer. The second way it'll work is with active ingredients such as clobetazole, lidocaine, or any other powder which can be incorporated. It'll aid the healing process.